bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you were we, we playing this yesterday? You ready? Weren't you playing this yesterday? Yeah. What? You ready wow, you actually dropped the burger. You're That's right. how great you Say, are. Same thing? Same thing? Yeah? Yeah. Round two. Whoa. It's improv, right? Yes, it is. <laughs> This morning I woke up with my mom all over my face. I was like, man, I gotta get to that working place to make that money. Gotta make that taste. Yeah, I gotta make that cheese, that cheddar. Whatever will get me a better house and a better wife. Cause all I wanna do is live my life. But how can I be? Guy, if I'm as a registered sex offender, I went to a playground <laughs> a and I pissed on the slide, and they said, No, you can't ride with this company no more. All I did was pee on the slide, I didn't fuck some little whore. Well, that kid was only four or five, and she saw my penis, and that's all right, but. Too bad her mom was there. She got real scared. She put her hands in the air. She said, Help me! I was like, Bitch, ah, don't look at me. <laughs> Saw my whole penis. Hairless penis. Hairy ass ball. She described it to the court. No report. I couldn't even file a report. She was like, Put this motherfucker back behind bars. And I was like, Oh, well, maybe I could be a porn star when I get out. I'm not gonna sag my pants in the pen. Some big black guy might think the stick is Big Ben in my ass if I walk around dressed like that, so I won't do it. But outside of school, it's okay to sag your pants. I mean, cuz it's not like no one's gonna pull down your boxers and stuff you in your booty pipe. I mean, it's like that'd be rape, right? Not in jail. Not in jail. And that's the moral of the story. That's the moral of the story. Don't sag your pants. <laughs> Is it over? You're done? You're in jail. It's done. It's done? Okay, okay, wait to send it. Oh, wait, wait. He was it Bob? Bob? I don't know. I'm from Mount Sinai.